vacancy. You know, no matter what. YouTube, this you know, is outside the ring. Each other out. Yeah, but you know, the CL. Uh, that's a lovely Lucy. Yeah, that's I, Mr. I, I, I thought it made sense to yeah. me. And that's the I super mean, fan. since you put it that way, I mean, I can, we can agree to disagree, but I, I, I thought it made sense. But after everything was said and done, Ricochet did wind up winning uh, the. Uh, I'm not mad if Ricochet no wins. No contender match. I, with I, I, a, uh, I want him to have some gold. By hitting the six. Hey man, uh, super fan. Yeah. Of, uh, Miz. I'm not mad. Ricochet. I'm not mad he, 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 he needs that. He needs that. I just that. didn't like how the match. So the match was just booked. Mm-hmm. Tragically, for me, to be honest, and, uh, it was tragic. It was. It was a tragic. Now, then we go to the ladies and gentlemen, Shaft. And, uh, Randy and Russ Taylor oh. taking on the Viking Raiders, Eric and Ivar. Oh, they, they showed up to work? Yeah, they did. <laughs> <laughs> they showed up to work, huh? Come on, Bill. No, come on. That, that wasn't a match, okay? <laughs> no, I meant like they actually hey. put them on TV. The right, 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 right. Okay. Yeah, the Viking Raiders. Yeah, they put them on. They were gone for a while. I guess they were on, <laughs> on so, vacation. So what did they Decatur do? Instead of actually giving them a match, they put them with Russ and Randy Taylor. Oh. This was like watching feeding time at the zoo. <laughs> <laughs> so these are they they uh, wrestle two jobbers. That's what you say. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Well. You remember back in the day, they used to do that all the time. I'm sorry. Yeah. Another back in the day reference. That's okay. Uh, hey, hey, not, not, sorry, not, sorry, not sorry, not sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Sorry, not sorry. So, that's what wrestling was about back in the day. The thing, they, you know, that's, how, that's what builds characters. That's what builds wrestlers. You you know, get some W's behind you. Yeah, but you know. these guys, they were sitting there starting them off hot. They benched them, and now they got to work in... Yeah, it doesn't make any sense. Tragic. So that's, I mean, again, it's making no sense. Tragic, off the bench. tragic booking. At his best. But I mean, it just, it was an ugly match from the word <laughs> go. Yeah. But it ended with the Viking experience. What they, nice. they former name is their, their finisher. Yeah, yeah. Their finisher is a pop-up power slam. Yeah. I mean, they are, I, they are like them, you know what I'm saying, as the look. You know what I'm saying? They have the, you know, especially when they was in NXT, man, it was the bomb. Yeah, they were. Yeah, they were. yeah. you know, yeah. just they got the main roster, just don't know what to do with these guys. Well, a lot of people, so let's go ahead. But, uh, then, uh, there was a little, um, incident, um, with the, uh, Sammy and Kevin show in which Kevin Owens blamed a technical difficulty for a game mm-hmm. called the KO show and not the Kevin and no, Sammy show. So. Wait a minute, so he, he doesn't agree with it being called the KO Sammy Show? or he No, didn't? no, he wanted it to be called the Kevin and Sammy Show. Okay. But, of course, they're blaming it on technical, technical difficulties, difficulties. Okay. With it being just called the Kevin Owens Show. Oh, okay. Well. Where are we going with this, though? They wound up having an interview with Baron Corbin. Oh. Baron Corbin sat there and decided that he always had a pl- uh, he has a backup plan. Yeah. And he